Full star, and he's the star now of radio. I'm talking about the one and only true American icon, Mr. Robert Conrad. Hey, listen, I always say this uh, because it's a very flowing uh, introduction, and uh, it wouldn't be possible for him to say all those very, very kind things uh, about yours truly if it weren't for you. And I just want to tell you that I don't go a day in my life without thinking and thanking you for being here where I want to be. I mean, I've got several opportunities to do some uh, movies uh, recently, and I'm fortunately not, uh, for the time being, uh, interested in doing that as part of my career. I always say in the, for the time being, because time passes no one. It uh, hurries by, have you heard that? Yeah, I've heard that. Now, have you ever heard this? When things get tough, the tough get going? That is correct. Who said that? Uh, was that Teddy Roosevelt? No, that was my mom. Was that your mom? Jackie. That said, yeah. Jackie said that to yeah. you. That get good. up! Get up! Damn it! Get up! Mm. And the kid says, who is that lady yelling like that at you? I said, oh, don't worry. It's my mom. <laughs> Football. Back in the day. That's the day. I love her. All my life. My sister Laura is listening. She is a regular listener to the show. And thanks, sweetheart, for listening. I love you. Your brother can't wait to see you. Uh, but uh, I, I know that jokes about mom are jokes that we can handle, right? Yes, we can, because it's just me and you, baby. Okay, I love you. We had another sister who unfortunately passed away. Her also name was Jackie. I named her after her mom. And then by my dad, I have uh, two brothers and a sister. So, you know, it's kind of all the Conrad uh, um, energy is spread. All you have over. spread the Conrad energy across the universe. Now, now, uh, I just can't tell you how much I appreciate uh, your friendship, you, you the, our radio listeners, because I've gotten from a, a guy I uh, met when I did a performance 12 years ago in France to 200,000 people, may I say, in wow. four days. Yeah, wow. it, was, it was at the Moran uh, Festival, and I met uh, Javier there, and um, now we've become friends, and when I go to Paris, I will see him. Well, not to Paris, to France, because he doesn't live in Paris. And also, I'll see our friend Jean-Luc. And then, of course, there's a lady lurking that I might see. So we'll see how that goes. But You've gotten lots of friends on this show. They have <laughs> called in and become part of your life. Well, I wanted to thank him for what he's done, the research on my career. This man is, is, has researched my entire career. And Javier, from the bottom of my heart, I thank you for that. Now, the most important correspondence I've had today is uh, this, and I get this every week, see it there? And that's a letter from my daughter, Nancy, that she writes to her dad every week. And every we, week, I like that. And we take it home and read it and, uh, and smile, usually. Usually, okay, that's good. It's well, you know Father's how, Day weekend coming well, up. Well, yes, know? when is Father's Day weekend? Sunday, this coming uh, Sunday. Yeah. That's gonna be a challenge. I, I probably will spend that with, uh, well, my dog, I guess I can't do it with my dog. I'm I've doing... lost my dog, too. You and I share that in common. Yeah. Oh, that's horrible. We're in yeah. trouble. We don't have our dogs. No, I'm going to get in September. I'm... I will do it with yeah. you. Yeah. Well, let's go to the pond. That's I will do it says. together with you. You know, everyone says go to the pond, so let's do that. Let's do that together. That's All a right. good uh, the Bob and Mike deal. That's good. CRN Travelers, relax.